Yeah, I mean, uh, anytime you start selling comps play, uh, obviously now we know what we're getting because we've been through the, uh, the league for a year. Uh, and, uh, you know, it's an exciting time. Our, our kids are ready to get back on the field, especially after what happened at Tennessee Tech. But we are certainly, certainly cautious about who's coming in here because Wofford is, a, is, the, is the team that really stuck it to us last year and beat us up pretty good on the last uh, game of the year. And uh, hopefully uh, that's a little bit of a reminder uh, as we continue to practice with these guys. Yeah. I hope so. I mean, you know, it's uh, you know, we got a family weekend, so it'll be a lot of a lot of people in town. Uh, we had over fourteen hundred, almost fifteen hundred students at the last game, which is a record. So there's a challenge out right now to have over two thousand students at the game, which would be really neat for a school with only twenty six hundred undergraduates on campus. Uh, so uh, there's a lot of neat things happening. Bottom line is, we got to prepare and get ready for a really good Wofford team coming in here. Mike Harris knows what he's doing. He's been doing it a long time, uh, and, and I think uh, you know our fans are going to get used. To to different teams coming and coming in here each year and uh, obviously Wofford will be back here uh, two years from now.